Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. Okay, today I have another uh, hot sauce from the Pepper Palace, uh, located in Sevierville, Tennessee. Now, the Pepper Palace is the planet's number one hot shop, so don't forget that. So I certainly hope that you have one located where you live, uh, because it's just an awesome place to uh, to visit. They've got uh, wonderful, wonderful products, uh, not only their own uh, products, but uh, they carry many others from... Uh, other companies as well but I'm gonna be reviewing one of their newer ones and this is called Cinnanero hot sauce this is a cinnamon and habanero hot sauce just check out that uh, very cool looking label with those cinnamon sticks and the habanero pepper very very cool um, so let me go ahead and uh, read the ingredients on this one very simple uh, we just start off with vinegar water habanero pepper salt sugar and cinnamon so I was very very uh, interested in trying this one because um, I've, I haven't really uh, had a, a lot or if any hot sauces that uh, that have cinnamon in them uh, so I was very intrigued by this one but just check out that beautiful looking uh, color nice red color on this one uh, not thick at all but it's not real real thin either but uh, now you can see those spices or the cinnamon definitely you know kind of coating to the to the bottle a little bit okay now let's go ahead and smell this wow this stuff just smells so good um you definitely get the cinnamon you smell you smell smell sweet um it kind of kind of smells uh, it reminds me of a of a hot uh, apple pie with uh, lots of cinnamon uh, for some reason, you know, I keep getting apple, um, but but it is, man, this stuff really, really smells good. Very unique. It doesn't smell vinegary at all, um, and that's the first ingredient. But uh, you smell a little bit of the spiciness from the habanero peppers, but not too much. But just a beautiful sweet cinnamon smell to it. All right, let's show you what it looks like. I did something pretty unique with this one, guys, so I'll show you here in a minute. Okay, here we go. Nice and smooth and rich. Mm. Wow. Mm. Absolutely delicious. And it's not too spicy either. Um, just a little bit, but not too much at all. But um, this is the type of hot sauce. I could see you just pouring this all over a not nice um, hot apple pie or a nice hot apple turnover that would just be incredible this stuff would be awesome on pancakes on waffles on ice cream uh, any type of dessert so I think this particular hot sauce is going to be work very well for desserts uh, rather than normal food if, uh, so to speak but I know that cinnamon goes very well with pork uh, I think this would be awesome on grilled pork as well uh, possibly even beef because um, cinnamon, if you didn't know that already, cinnamon works very well with beef as well. But I decided to do something totally different. I'm always trying to think of unique and creative ways to use hot sauces. Uh, so I decided to spice up my cup of mocha java that I was having one morning. So there's a picture of it right there. Um, I started off with a teaspoon uh, in the cup of uh, coffee, uh, but just uh, wasn't spicy enough or didn't think it was working well enough, so I added another teaspoon. Perfect. Two teaspoons of this in a nice mug of uh, coffee really spiced it up, gave it a nice spiciness, nice cinnamon flavor, and it worked very, very well. So um, this is really good. If you're a fan of cinnamon, if you're a fan of habaneros, you're a fan of hot sauces, uh, this one's a winner. Uh, guys, you're going to love this one. I'll give this a strong 9 out of 10. Uh, for flavor and on heat, it is about a 3 on my 1 to 10 scale. But wonderful new product from Pepper Palace. Make sure you check this stuff out, guys. Give them a like on Facebook. And the website simply is pepperpalace.com. All right, guys, thank you so much for sending it. I appreciate it. And, guys, thank you so much for watching. And until the next time, make sure you enjoy the burn. We'll see you later.